Thank you very much. It's my great honor. I never thought that I would be standing here talking to you like this. Because last year, our Alibaba had an IPO. It was a great IPO. And people said, you are so smart. How could you make a company like that? But before the IPO, a lot of people said Alibaba is a terrible model. There was a problem here and there. The founder is terrible. Yes, that's right. I'm a 100% made in China. <laughs> I learned my English by myself. And I tried to teach myself how to program on computer. I still don't know wh why, how it works. But that is not important. Like all of you here, we all have expectation for the future. We all worry about the future. I did not have a rich father. Not from, uh, you know, well-educated. I said I tried three times for university. All failed. For the last time, I, I went to the teacher's college, which was considered the third or fourth class of my city. But I think that is the best university I've ever had. Better than Harvard and Wharton. <laughs> I applied for Harvard for 10 times. All failed. They don't even want to see me. You know, terrible. <laughs> and I, I think that is a normal life. Right? And I, I believe that um, it was so difficult at that time. I was so frustrated because I taught in the university. My pay was $10 a month. It was not easy, but I believe that something, something is waiting for me there. And I have to work hard to prove myself. So that was the tough experience. And I never thought I was smart. Nobody believed that I could be successful because everybody said, well, this guy think differently, think crazily. You know, they think about something that never worked. In 1994, discussed that I'm going to do something called internet. And 23 of them against it. They said, this is a stupid idea, right? We have never heard about internet. And you know nothing about computer. Why you want to do the computer? So nobody agreed with it. As I said, I believe it. Because I saw the computer in 1994 when I went to the USA. I think this thing could be big. But I never thought it would be that big like today. Honestly, people say you are smart, you, are, you have a big vision, 1994, since you saw the internet. That was not true. I just want to find a job because I could not find a good job, so I do myself. So, that is the history. <clears throat> That's the thing. And now, after f 16 years, we have a lot of, we have an Alibaba group, we have a Tmall group, we have a Taobao group, we have an Alipay. And people say, how you make it? Why this make it? Why people cannot find opportunities, you can find opportunities. And I think people, same here today. Jack, where is the opportunity? I don't have a job. I don't have this. I don't have that. I remember 20 years ago, I, I hated Bill Gates. I say he took all the job, you know. He's a, such a great. And Larry Page, Bill Gates, and every success people, they did a good. And why I didn't have this chance? The same question like you. And later, I calm down myself. And luckily, I win. I tell you, I'm lucky to know a lot of famous people. Bill Gates, Warren Buffett, Jack Welch, Larry Page, Mark Zuckerberg. I know all of them. I would like to share with you that those people, the difference between those people and other people, they are always optimistic for the future. They never complain. They always try to solve the problems of the others. And I think, where is the opportunity? The opportunity li always lies in the place where people complain. Some people sit there complain. You think, mm, if I can solve that complaint, that's the opportunity. That's what I did. And I think 1994, 1995, so many people in China want to sell things abroad. But there's no place because the big business can go to the trade fair, Las Vegas fair, and Germany fair. Small business, they don't have opportunity. So they complain, we, we want to go to trade shows, but they cannot get visa, they don't have money, they don't have a relationship. So I think if internet can help this small business, it will be great. 
But nobody would believe it. Why internet can help? Well, I said, if, if something everybody believe it, everybody love it, forget about it, that's not a, your opportunity. Because when everybody agrees, why this opportunity should be yours? Because a lot of people don't agree with it. And you think this is good, think carefully and find a group of people working together. And making sure the people working with you together believe the dreams. Whether investors believe in this or not, whether your friends believe it or not, whether your parents believe it or not, that's not important. You believe it. Your team believe it. And work day and night on this. That's how the things happen. Right. My investor did not, inv after 10 years they invested us, they still don't know what I'm doing. Honestly, people say, "Why, well, Jack, you have such so many great investors. Yeah, they are great because they believe Jack Ma can do something. But what exactly he's doing, they probably don't understand. But we have to know. We know the only thing I tell you guys, for the first three years, we do not have even one dollar revenue from our business. But why it keeps us going ahead? going forward because I received lots of email of thanks from the customer they say this is such a great thing if you can keep on doing that we cannot pay you but this thing helped us if you keep on helping us one day you will be successful and I believe this and I want people here to let you know that we are at the best time of this century the first technology revolution, the steam, the water, right, in the UK, very successful after 50 years. The second technology revolution is called uh, energy revolution, electricity. After 50 years, electricity was founded, business booming. Internet has only for 20 years. The next 30 years is the best time for us, for our young people. We are all lucky, we are, only, we are only like 20, 30 years old. The next 30 years, the best time. The last 20 years is the time I call information technology. That's the IT. IT is to make, your, make the big company getting bigger and stronger. And IT is to make yourself stronger. IT is try to get something for you. But now we are entering into the new period which I call the data technology. The data technology is do totally opposite of IT. IT is I have, you don't have. DT is you have it, I don't have it. I don't have to have it. DT is about a sharing. DT is about taking responsibility. DT is about a passion for the future. So we are coming into the next 30 years of data technology period, which your parents may not like it. Which your friends may not like it, but if you believe the next 30 years is the wonderful period for us. And by the way, at the DT period, everybody is the same. Because we are stuck from the same line. Nobody is the expert of DT. There are a lot of experts of IT, they may be in trouble. So, what I would say, the best, the best assets you have is that you are young. Don't complain. Let the other people complain. Those people complain, those people who fail. And do not always say, well, I don't have. Think about how you can make things different. Use your own brain to think. Lastly, I want to share you, I learned my English. I learned how to think use my own brain. When I was young, I went to Hangzhou West Lake. You know, we have a West Lake. There's a hotel. Many foreign visitors visit there. And I went there every morning, five o'clock, to practice my English. The foreign visitors come, I practice my English. I don't know why at that time. But I found everything the foreign visitors told me are so different from the things my parents told me, my teacher told me, and the newspaper I read. So since then, I think everything used my own brain to think about. Is that true? Is that an opportunity inside? Is there anything I can do that make the difference? Think about this. 
And then when you think about this, start to do it. I saw a lot of people, young people, have fantastic ideas every evening. But in the morning, they go to the office same again. Make the move. Make the action. To everybody, to any person, tomorrow is new. And believe one thing, this is also another last advice I want to give you. You have to work very hard. Right? Either work for the others or work for yourself. And I choose the way, work my, for myself. But working for myself, that means working for the society. If you really want to work for yourself, think about the others. The day DT time, making sure you help others. Because only when the other, ha other people are successful, when the other people are happy, you will be successful, you will be happy. Thank you very much.